Hey, my name is Phil from LegitMarketingReviews.com. In today's video, we're going to be looking at an AI copywriting tool called GoCharlie. Now in this GoCharlie AI review, I'm gonna show you exactly what GoCharlie is, how it actually works, and by the end of this video, you should know if it's right for you. And if you are thinking about getting started with GoCharlie, I have left a link in the description. They are currently having a promotion, so if you wanna save some money on GoCharlie, make sure you check that out. So first of all, what is GoCharlie AI? Well, it is an AI copywriting tool that allows you to create articles with just one click. You can also create different types of blog posts and short form content, things like ads and social media posting. And then finally, you can create different types of images using their AI engine, so you can get really creative with what comes out. Now the cool thing about GoCharlie is they have been mentioned in Wall Street Journal already with some of the big AI copywriting tools, plus they are getting a lot of traction in all of the AI Facebook groups out there. So it's safe to say this tool is getting quite a lot of exposure and it is growing significantly quick. So what I'm gonna do right now, instead of telling you about GoCharlie, I'm actually gonna show you how it works. So let's go behind the screen and see GoCharlie. Okay, so first of all, we're going to start here at the GoCharlie website. What I first wanna do is run through some different information about GoCharlie. I'll then go through the different features and then finally the different pricing before we go into the dashboard and I'll show you how this tool actually works. So the first thing to note is they do have a dog here as the mascot of the brand. So there are quite a few different dog references throughout the site. I think it's actually pretty cool how they've done it. It's made it a little bit more lighthearted. Now what you will also notice, if you come down just a little bit, it has also been mentioned as product hunt, number one product of the day, which is always good to see when I see that symbol. And if we come down, this is basically how it works. Super easy to use. Pick your use case, input a description, and then fetch the content. See, fetch, it's pretty, pretty funny. So if we come down, this is the different types of features inside of GoCharlie. They mainly focus on things like blog posts, how you can generate a thousand plus word blog post with just one click. So that's pretty cool. Or you can build it manually using the wizard. They also have social media so you can create things like ads, captions, and everything in between. You can also create different imagery, which is pretty interesting. I've made some pretty crazy images with it. And then finally, one I haven't actually tested out personally is the content repurposing, where you can go and extract a YouTube's captions inside of YouTube, and you can turn it into a blog post. So this is amazing if you are a YouTube content creator. You can actually get your content, put it inside a GoCharlie, and it's going to spit out an SEO friendly blog so pretty incredible to see this is actually something I can see myself using quite a lot I currently have a writer but I'm thinking about maybe testing this out instead it may be a little bit more accurate so coming down there's just a few more things inside of here but they always talk about a marketer's best friend like a dog so it's pretty cool to see now let's quickly go over the pricing this is something that is probably going to change quite a bit over time right now they actually have a lifetime deal going for two different plans they have the lifetime unlimited which basically means it's unlimited as you can imagine. There is also the fair usage policy, so you can't just use this tool all day every day on you know, some crazy type of bot script. You will probably be capped, but if you're just a regular user and you create, I don't know, 100 articles a month, this is going to be the plan you want. If you're not a power user like that, you can also get the $99 deal, which is probably something I'm going to stick with. I was thinking about upgrading, but I currently have the 99. And this is going to allow you to have 35 blog posts per month, unlimited short form copy, plus you can have 175 4K vertical or widescreen images per month, and you can repurpose 35 different pieces of content. So this is more than enough for if you run your own business, maybe you're only having one to two people working for you as well, so it's like a small business. This would be perfect because you know it's not super heavy in terms of usage, but if you are something like an SEO agency or you're just doing a lot of projects, you can definitely use the, um, the unlimited. Now, once the lifetime deal ends, which I believe is going to be in the next week, so something to think about, the monthly plan is going to be the Fetch Monthly, $29 per month. If you go annually, of course, you save two months three, and you just get unlimited monthly usage, once again, subject to fair usage policy. So it's an extremely affordable tool versus some of the main competitors, things like Jasper. Um, you'll be paying an arm and a leg versus Go Charlie, which is currently 29 a month. But I can almost guarantee over the next few months, this price is going to increase because this is far too affordable for what they're actually providing. And you'll see once we go through the different features.
And then finally, if you just want to test it out, there's also the fetch free. So I highly recommend if you are thinking about getting one of these other plans, go ahead and have a test for yourself. Once again, link in the description if you want to go and test it and help support the channel. And then you can go from there. So what I'm going to do right now is go ahead, log into GoCharlie and show you how it works. Okay, so this is my GoCharlie dashboard and I have to admit I really like the layout on the homepage once you first get in. Now inside on the left we have all of the different types of content that you can choose from and I've also added it here in the middle and put little icons to represent sort of what it's about. So if we come down, everything that's listed here is listed out in a flat sort of layout which is pretty cool and it's safe to say there are plenty of different types of AI templates to choose from. So I'm sure there's more than enough for all of your use cases, right? Now, one thing to note as well is they are continually adding new features inside of it. For example, Charlie's Playpen was just added six days ago. Content repurposing, I believe, slightly more. So if you wanted to stay up to date with all of the releases, I'd recommend going and joining their Go Charlie AI Facebook group. Reason being is the guy that owns it, Brennan Woodruff, he is often posting things like this, talking about the new features that have just been added. For example, Charlie's Playpen. We've also got rewrite how it's just been expanded and so forth so it's pretty cool to see the the community is also extremely engaging um, so it's really nice to be a part of something that everyone's excited to use and it's continually getting better so let's go ahead and test out some of the different templates. Obviously, I can't go through all of these in this video or it'll be a few hours long, but let's go over the main ones I see people using, which is definitely going to be the one-click blog. Now, the one-click blog, you have to keep in mind it's not going to be absolutely perfect in terms of SEO and optimization. However, it is gonna be a really, really good start. And me personally, I see myself using this for when I create new types of websites, either for myself or for clients, because I can go ahead, get some different types of content for the website just so it looks filled when I give the first sort of initial look of the website to a client, right? You don't want to give them an empty site with no content. So this is where GoCharlie is actually a really good tool. You can create full articles. You can also get different types of content as well. It's just going to save yourself so much time instead of, you know, scratching your head or putting in different types of default text. Um, holders type things. So let's go ahead and start a article. I'm just going to do something generic just so you can see how it works. So I might put inside here how to improve your sleep, right? Could be the blog title. Target audience could be people with insomnia, right? And keywords could be, you know, improve improve your sleep and just keep in mind the more keywords you put in um, probably better I wouldn't go more than say six but I would, I would probably put in more than three just so it keeps a bit of context so improve your sleep sleep better um, sleep longer how to sleep um, better and maybe one more which is going to be um, how to sleep a full night, right? So it's some pretty interesting keywords there. Let's go ahead, click on right. I should probably also mention as well, select goal at the top right. We also have inform, explain, curious, persuade, and entertain. So depending on your tone of voice would be whichever one you want. So I'm gonna leave it on inform. And what I'm gonna do is go ahead and actually time this to see how long it takes. Okay, so the article has now been generated. It took one minute and 29 seconds. So in the grand scheme of things, there's an extremely fast way to create this type of content, especially considering the size. If you look down here, it's gone ahead and written 1,878 words, which is massive. That's absolutely massive. I can't believe how big it is. But the biggest and most important thing is what it actually says. Now, just before we get into it, there are a few additional features inside of here. We have, first of all, the tone. This is going to allow you to choose a tone in which you rewrite different types of content. They've got some pretty funny ones inside of here as well. I'm not too sure what they're all about. I haven't tried them myself, but you have Pirate. You've also got Rick. But important ones are first person narrative. We've also got um, smart and different things like that. So I'm, I'm not too sure about this. I probably won't use this type of feature, but it's there if you want to get creative. And we also have some additional features to the right of it. We've got here rewrite. We've also got write more. If you hover over it, it'll bring up the label. We've also got copy and also save. So if you are modifying this piece of content, make sure you save it before you quit as well. So let's have a look at the content. 
First, we have our title, our H1 tag. You can change everything in here as well. We also have multiple different types of headings, right? So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine different uh, headings. Well, they're all H2s by the look of it. And looking at what they're actually talking about, insomnia, what is it and how to in identify it? This is extremely targeted to the main keyword, the causes of insomnia, the effects of insomnia, um, how to improve your sleep hygiene, sleep aids and their effectiveness, when to see a doctor about your insomnia, creating a sleep schedule, tips for falling asleep and staying asleep. So these are all extremely accurate to how to improve your sleep. Probably not 100% accurate in terms of it's really targeted to insomnia. Maybe if I change my keyword to people that can't sleep good or something like that, maybe it'll make it better. But overall, it's very well targeted in the general scheme of it. So let's have a look at this first uh, few sentences. I'm not going to read the entire thing. Feel free to pause this video if you want to read what's on the screen. But if you're like most people, you probably don't get enough sleep. In fact, according to the National Sleep Foundation, 64% of Americans report that they don't get enough sleep on a regular basis. This is great because you could directly link that to um, the article about it. Lack of sleep can lead to a number of health problems, including obesity, heart disease, and diabetes. It can also negatively impact your mood, memory, and the ability to concentrate. So you can see it sounds really nice. It's probably writing better than I could personally write myself. So overall, I think this is great. Now, I'm not going to spend too much time reading through it, but you can see it's good content. It's also got things like points, which is nice to see. And uh, overall, it's, it's not bad. It's actually got a link in there. That's really impressive. So overall, that is the one-click blog article generator. If you need to create content quickly, if you don't have the time to go ahead and research it, you can go and use this feature to create a bunch of content. Now, if you were to go ahead and structure out your content individually, I'd recommend using the blog wizard. This is going to allow you to fetch different types of topics. You can also choose your different headings, and then it's going to just write the parts that you need, for example, the paragraphs, and you can structure your content a little bit better. Same exact thing though. So let's go ahead and look at some of the different features. I don't want to make this video too long. We have images. This is becoming an extremely hot topic. I'm seeing it used more and more in Facebook groups and on different websites. Let's go have a look at image creation. We also have image to alt text and image to text. But let's describe our image in as much detail as possible. So I'm going to type in here monkey king on a moon planet, something like that. Um, I could even write in something else with lots of jewelry. I hope there it is. It's auto-corrected itself. So aspect ratio, we can choose square, widescreen, or vertical. So I might just put widescreen. It could be something like a poster I put on a wall. Image size, HD, 2K, or 4K. So you can choose the quality you want. I'll just leave it at HD to render a little bit faster. And you can choose either a photo or art. I'm going to put it on art to get quite creative. And let's go ahead and see what it does with based on the, the ingredients I've given it. Now I'll pause the video once again. I'm not sure how long this will take, so I'll time it and let you know. Okay, so we have two different types of images. It's given us two, which is quite nice to see. Uh, the first one took about 12 seconds and the second one took about an additional 12 seconds. So I could have kept the video going, but that saved a little bit of time. So here we have it. This is our monkey king on moon planets with lots of jewelry. And um, it's pretty creative, I guess you could say. It's got a monkey, he's a king, he's got lots of jewelry. There's a moon in the background. I guess it makes sense. I personally haven't found many use cases for these image creation type things just yet. I see people making some pretty cool ones with like astronauts and things like that, but I just, I'm, I'm not that sort of creative type of person. But if you have a use case for it, just know that you can use this as much as you want. Once again, if you're on the $99 lifetime plan, you can still have 175 of the 4K images. I believe you have unlimited of the lower resolution. So this is here if you want it. You can play around with the different photos and things like that. I'll quickly use the photo, see if it makes much difference. So I'll pause the video and time this one more time. Okay, so that took about 20 seconds per image this time. Um, they've, it's amazing what people, well, I guess the AI can come up with. Like this one is actually pretty cool. It's got like a smoke thing in the background, a moon, of uh, lots of jewelry once again, and he's a monkey king. Same thing here, except this time he's got a buddy. So it looks like it might be a mask. Interesting. It's very confusing, but overall it's done exactly what I asked for. 
and the results aren't too bad. So you can spend endless time inside of here, I'm sure, creating some work of art, depending on what you need it for. Once again, it will depend on how much you use it. So let's go ahead and move forward. I'll test out one more tool. There is way too much to choose from inside of here. But one of my biggest struggles with online marketing is always email marketing. If you've joined my newsletter, you'll probably notice you don't get many emails, which is something I'm working on. So let's go ahead and have a look at the email feature. I'm always excited to see the email um, functionality added in AI copywriters. So as you can see, they only have two different sections, the brand name and of course, describe your welcome email. So what I can put inside of here is legit marketing reviews. And then for describe your welcome email, what I'll do is quickly pause the video and add up a little brief. It's saying in your own words, describe the welcome email you want to create or your brand. Okay, so I've put inside here, legit marketing reviews helps entrepreneurs and small businesses find the right marketing software to help grow their businesses as fast as possible. This welcome email will explain what legit marketing reviews can do to, to help them and their businesses as well as inform them to subscribe to my YouTube and social media channels. So hopefully that's right. I see here you can actually output the, um, the language, which is really interesting. They've got so many languages inside of here. I'd have to guess there'd be at least 40 inside of there. So if you are someone that speaks a different language or your target market is in a different language or different area, then you can also play with that. But once again, hopefully I've done this right. I'll go ahead and click on fetch and let's see what it comes out with. Okay, so that took less than five seconds. I could have kept recording, but very impressed with the speed of it. So let's come down and have a look at the copy. Now, by the looks of it, you can also use their image generator to actually create an image for your email if you wish. I'm not gonna use it this time, but feel free to play around with this if you want. But the first bit of copy says, hello name, my name is name, and I'm the founder of Legit Marketing Reviews. Our goal is to help entrepreneurs and small businesses grow their business as fast as possible by providing the best marketing software available. Our reviews are unbiased and we will never promote a product we don't believe in. We know that finding the right marketing software can be difficult, so we've put together this welcome email to explain what Legit Marketing Reviews can do for you. In, ad in addition, we encourage you to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on social media for more information and updates about the latest marketing software products. Thank you for considering us as your go-to source for information about marketing software. So that is ridiculous. I really love that. I might even use that as my welcome email. It does make sense. It's not super personal, but at the same time, um, we haven't really put in any fields to make it personal. So very impressed with that first one. Second one, hello, thank you for considering legit marketing reviews as your source of the best marketing software on the market. Our reviews are recommended and our reviews and recommendations are designed to help entrepreneurs and small businesses grow their business as fast as possible. So it's all the same sort of thing, rewritten in different ways. So I guess what you would do is come and sign, find the one that you like, go ahead and click save content. It's going to go and save it to your content library and then you can use it later on. So overall, I think this is pretty cool. If you know exactly what your business is about, what your brand is about, you could spend maybe a half an hour inside of here and you could build an email sequence quite easily. They've got everything from email subject line, sales emails, angel investor email pitch. You also have promotional email and there's plenty inside of here too. But that's basically Go Charlie guys. You've probably seen a lot of AI copywriting tools by now. This one has got a few extra features like the one click blog generator. The output is amazing. And overall, this is just a solid tool. I'm really excited to see where it goes in the future. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna jump behind this, the camera just one more time to talk about a few extra things. Okay, so that is Charlie AI. As you can see, it is such a powerful tool and it has so many different types of features and templates ready for you to use. Now for me personally, I love the one-click blog article generator. This is just going to help me build websites really quickly and then I can put some content inside of it, which is still relevant. It's just not going to be absolutely perfect, but this is going to save so much time. And then of course, I love the email functionality. I'm not 100% sure quite how to create the images yet, but if you are someone that wants to get creative with images, I 100% recommend to go and test it out. But overall, GoCharlie is one of these AI copywriters which is going to stick around for a long time. And once again, it's been mentioned in Wall Street Journal and it is growing extremely fast. So I would probably jump on board sooner rather than later if you're thinking about getting an AI copywriting tool and GoCharlie might be the perfect one for you. So once again, that is my GoCharlie review. If you are thinking about getting it, I've also left that link in the description to the current lifetime deal and pricing. 
So if you want to check that out, make sure you use that link. You'll also be helping support the channel. But that's it from me. Thanks for stopping by and checking out this Go Charlie review. And I look forward to seeing you on the next video.